Casey Kunimura, and in two days, I'll be 99. My experience with the 40 and 8, I was in the American Legion, and a boxcar was in uh, Salt Lake City. Uh, it was uh, deteriorating, and we decided we wanted to bring the boxcar and clean it up and get it into uh, some kind of a viewing shape. So we brought the boxcar from behind the uh, uh, state, it, was, it wasn't behind the state building. That park back there? Yeah. Memory Grove. It was Memory, Memory Grove. Grove. Memory. Right. And we brought it, we brought it here, and uh, that's how that boxcar got here, it, into uh, uh, August. And now we're just, we, we need to take care of it. We need, we need to, uh, you know, work on it and get it to a shape where it looks presentable. And, um, I understand that we now have the fund to do so. Yes, they're working on that part. Yes. Mm -hmm. They are working on getting the rest of the money together to do that. Yes. Yeah. So this is uh, this is our story about the box car. It was it was uh, you know as you know that the box car basically became famous during World War One uh, when they were transporting American troops in uh, France. And then we partially used it during World War II uh, uh, to transport some of the trees when we didn't have enough uh, uh, trucks and, and buses and so forth out of uh, France into different parts of Europe. And I just happened to uh, unload at the Normandy and uh, I guess they didn't have any uh, military vehicles, so they took us down and put us on this box car uh, and uh, for, uh, to transport us from La Harve to uh, Marseille, where, where I joined my unit. And that was about, a, I don't know, 10, 10 days, 14 days, it was somewhere in there that it took us to get from uh, La Harve to uh, uh, Marseille. But that's my experience with the box car. It was quite a ride. Casey, Kunimura, and in two days, I'll be 99. <laughs> Your country, my country, it, regardless of what anybody say, come first. Amen. Amen. Okay. I don't care who you are, what you are, you, me, you, hey. Our country, right? That's my my belief, my philosophy, and I can't think of a better way or better place to be, or to have been able to spend as much time as I did in the service of my country, which was throughout my life.